seemed to fall asleep There was so much on my mind I was searching for that peace But that peace I could not find and Then I knelt down to pray I was praying, Lord, help me please Then he said, you don't have to cry Cause I'll supply all your needs As soon as I stop worrying Worrying how the story ends And I let go and I let God I let God have his way that's when things start happening And I stop looking at back then And I let go and I let God I let God have His way So let go and let God Let go and I let God Let go, let God Oh, let go, and let God let go. I will let God, yeah, let go. And I let God let go. Let God, oh, let go, and let God. As soon as I stop worrying, Worrying how the story ends And I let go and I let God I let God have His way That's when things start happening When I stop looking at back then And I let go and I let God I let God Oh, have your way, Jesus. Yeah, have your way. As I let go and I let you be God. I love the words of that song, let go and let God, and yet how often has it been so hard to live life like we are. Hi, my name is Lee Wiggins. I'm the pastor at Calvary Fellowship in Downingtown, and I'm so happy to be able to say hello to you today. I would love to read to you from 1 Peter chapter 1, verse 3. Listen to these words. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. According to his great mercy, he has caused us to be born again to a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. Well, a lot of our hopes have died this last month. That probably shouldn't be, but it is, isn't it? That's why some of us are frustrated. Some of us are down even today. But the fact of the matter is when we read this, we're reminded, no, there is just one hope, and his name is Jesus. And he's risen from the dead. And the way he expresses that hope is he says, that hope's a living hope, not one that can die, not one that can be taken away from us, but one that we can count on forever. Jesus is alive. A friend of mine once said that um, your life bears a message, a message of hope. And then he said this, he goes, but they're gonna see you first. And I just wonder to myself, oh, what do people see when they see me? I want them to see a message of hope. I want them to see a message of living hope. I want them to see Jesus in me. I hope that's what they see in you today. And I wanna pray for you along those lines and just pray that over you. As, as you say no to those things that died, those things prove there's, there's no hope in them. And there's only one who's proven by coming up out of the grave alive that he is our hope. Jesus, I pray that each person listening to this will be blessed right now. I pray that each one would grab onto you, the name of Jesus, the name that's above every other name. Lord Jesus, the one who came out of the grave alive with victory over death, with victory over sin. And Lord Jesus, I pray that we'll put you first in our lives today and everyone watching on, they'll be able to look at our lives and say, man, something's different. Yeah, that's the hope they have in Jesus that makes them so joyful today. 
Bless each one watching this, we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. Have a wonderful day.